camera at Lookout Mountain located just shy of 7,400 feet. 41 degrees temperature up at Lookout Mountain. Look at that. I mean, you can just literally the sun coming up this very moment this morning. Oh, what a sight it is in Colorado to look out in that direction. Temperatures in the 30s for most of us around Denver, Boulder and Fort Collins, although we are at 43 here downtown Denver at CBS 4. We benefit from the urban heat island, all the asphalt, all the concrete keeps temperatures a little bit warmer than they would otherwise be. You get away closer to Lyman where there's far less concrete and asphalt. It's a lot colder. 34 in Lyman. We've got 29 in Bailey, 25 in Leadville, 27 right now in Summit County at Frisco. Later today, highs will be in the 40s in the Frisco area, 50s for Aspen and Avon down toward Gunnison and Crested Butte as well. We'll see 60s meanwhile on the western slope and 50s for the most part on the eastern plains. Speaking of the plains, there have been a few rain showers this morning and it's still raining along portions of I-76 between Fort Morgan and Sterling. If your travels take you in that direction, down in southeast Colorado, Colorado, some rain around La Junta. Here along the Front Range, we are now mainly dry. We did have some rain overnight in a few neighborhoods, but the rest of today we should be dry. Jet stream is directly on top of us. That's what's causing those showers out on the plains this morning. And as the jet slowly shifts east, it's going to generate a lot of wind today. That wind will start to pick up late this morning into this afternoon. Uh, on the east side of the storm system at the base of the jet stream, there is an enhanced threat for severe weather today. Cities like New Orleans, large hail, damaging wind, tornadoes possible down in the deep south today as well. Again, the jet stream is shifting east, and as it does, it's going to allow this big ridge of high pressure to build in. That's going to mean beautiful weather around here for tomorrow and Saturday. Statewide, sunny skies and much warmer than normal temperatures. And then our attention goes to this storm system on the west coast. That'll move in for Easter Sunday, bringing a us much cooler weather and a pretty decent chance for rain from Saturday night through Monday. We've got the chance for rain showers. Highs will be in the 50s on those days. It's not going to be a complete washout for Easter Sunday, Andrea. But look out for a 30% chance for rain in the morning, a 50% chance in the afternoon.